Hey there, folks. This is Bobo the Vulture, and it is time for more Let's Play Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. And we are very sorrowful here that we are looking at this painting that appears to be a painting of, uh, I don't know, a statue falling over and the castle on fire and, like, demon skeletons back there or some such. It's a very confusing image. But, uh... Let's keep going. I will say, folks, uh, be forewarned, it's very windy outside, and I have seen the lights in my apartment dim twice in the past minute. So there is the possibility that this stream will be cut short, as my power is cut short. Although my apartment is generally pretty reliable for electricity. I cannot recall us having a blackout for any extended period of time. My swing was too slow. I tried using a giant hammer, um, and my swing was too slow to be able to uh, whack at the uh, little tiny uh, sickles that came around. Oh, jeez. It's going to be forever to get back to a uh, another place to sort of explore around. Piss. And you have to go through the whole clock tower, too. Hmm. I'll give death another good shot. Keep trying to uh, optimize my equipment here. That was actually pretty good. I like that. Give death a shot. What do you what could you possibly have to lose? get me through the first stage a lot faster, although I probably should just have saved the MPs. Gosh. Now then, do I stick with the uh, deadly spinning wheel thing? Or... Or do I go back to daggers and give myself a little bit of uh, safety and range? Alright, if you keep doing this... Ah! I did not know a good way to, uh... to avoid that particular attack. Don't I have potions to heal myself with? I have, like, a potion. I'm trying not to use potions all the time. But yes, I have died to this person many, many times. Tell you what, though, if I save... If I save using the uh, spinning disc attacks until late, late in the game, I'm just a little more careful in the early stages here. 
I say, and then I keep getting. And I did slightly worse, actually, this time. Item use. I have a high potion and a tasty meat. And I've got raw meat. That's not going to be very useful to me. I've got a high potion. Maybe I didn't duck in time. Let's see whether or not I still have that high potion. Wouldn't it be a shame if that got used on that fight? And I didn't have it back now. Oh, no, it didn't. Well, that's something. We're getting closer. Little bit more cautious play, perhaps. Keep moving. Ah. How much better did I do this time, guys, right? Use. There we go. High potion. Heal it up. Yay! Ow. And I still got in one last getting hit. Death. Attacks enemies using sickle. Well, wasn't that a thing? Let's go ahead and save the game. And uh, let's go into the soul set here. Let's go back to Evil Butcher, I guess. And death is here. I can attack enemies using sickles that way if I wanted to. Meanwhile, let's go back to Ghost Dancer. That's dumb. They just sort of flutter around at random. Skula allows you to walk while underwater. 
skulle, skulle, skulle out of time. Yes, that is the school of dance. Sorry, everyone. You got schooled. Well, good. That will unlock new areas for us to go to. Now, what enemy is here now? None. Okay. I should have saved going back and getting the Skola ability, but what the heck. Thank you, Size of Death. Now I have room to come in here without getting hurtified by those guys. Now I know I can't do anything over to the left. So let's drop down. Oh wait, can I? Is this where that water was? No, it was just another hall. thousand dollars somehow knew that was going to be a calamity Yay, death. Alright, fine. I won't kill you. I really kind of wanted to kill those lightning dolls. I hear the lightning dolls have... I read someplace that the lightning dolls have a really neat uh, soul. I haven't gone into... Uh, in-depth explanations of everything that's uh, cool and tough and tough and cool. Okay, didn't stay there forever and ever. As I thought it might do. Let's go ahead and save the game now that we're down here. We have that uh, ability to uh, sink in the water if we want to. Goku would never be able to survive down here. Sup, devil. Anything cool here other than these couple of lightning dolls? Don't much seem like it. All right. This seems like it would be difficult to return back from.
A burr tang. What is that? A burt gang. It's a mystical sword of protection. It does increase our defense and vastly increases our attack. Oh, come on, I thought I was standing on the uh, brass balls. Well, I sort of anticipated that, but what are you going to do? Okay, it increases our attack, but, uh... Yeah, okay. Nice. I don't know, are we losing poison damage or something? Is that what's going on? All the exciting jumping puzzles in an area with Medusa heads. You know how they like to do that to you. I believe I see what's over there that's trying to entice me into picking up. Pitch black suit. It's the bitch black suit. It uh, would reduce our attack, but increase our defense by a good bit, and raise our intelligence while lowering our strength. Oh, there you go. And we don't look any better. I guess the question becomes, how do we plan on getting out of here? seems to be able to hurt me very much, and yet I'm not really able to advance very well. And yes, it is that Valkyrie that's giving me problems, but she's also an evasive little something or other. These ones are non-fatal ones. Okay. There you go. And... Oh, I thought I was going to be able to... There's not invincibility frames here. Is... Are there? Yes. Is there? Are there? No, there aren't. There you go. It's true, Lethal. Clock Towers tend to be an irritation in these Castlevania games. I would say generally they're more of an annoyance than an actual, uh, you know, um, thing that's going to stop you from doing what you need. Oh, I don't want to take that hit in the face. Going back. I don't want to take that hit in the face either. I'm being whiny today. And going to the soul set, we now have the Soul. That lets me sink.
Now, I know that we can get over here. Just have to be uh, a little cautious, I guess. Here, these guys have nothing to offer me, do they? Other than their charming little ways. No, you're fine. Don't worry about that atrocity. just a little bit better performance on these I said a little better performance Maybe we go after these one at a time. Oh, right. And the devil's still there. He's the devil that defies heaven. I really do want those items. They seem like they're very good items. They're a little difficult to reach. With my, uh... Yeah. Sorry, I was a little distracted a moment ago by, uh... Something off screen, so now I am trying to recuperate. There we go. Now, as long as you can do it once, you're fine, because hopefully. have enough of a uh, of an ability that you can not even go in that direction. Let's see what's over here. Not a devil. Oh good, more of you guys. Ten bucks. Woo! So I managed to take out how many different enemies with one strike, I don't know. Sure seemed like a lot.
There. Dead. And here is a mirror room. Cool. And needles I somehow had to uh, get absorbed into. Oh, this is going to reconnect other parts of the castle, I guess. If I want to drop down that way, I don't know that I do, though. We've been that way before. That way is dull. I want to get this armor and sword and such. Death was conquered. Bomber armor has an astound astounding amount of destructive power. Ouch, 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 ouch. Let's go in here to uh, Well, I bet that has an astounding amount of destructive power. Let's use the bat ability. That sounds good. Here, let's... Deuce ahead, the ability to stop in midair. But how much did that use? Ten. Wow. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Check here. Yeah, they sort of set, uh, sort of set up these teleport rooms so that they're generally speaking not really that close to, uh, save rooms, don't they? And then back this way. Yes, here we go. Oh yeah, and I have to use a... Uh, I have to use a soul that will allow me to sink in water. Then I have to use a soul that will allow me to rise up. Or, you know, just not use a soul, I suppose that is also an option. You did! I see you, you did! And that's fine. We just need to get over here save the game. And there, we have saved the game. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and call this one a video for YouTube. Uh, when we come back next time, folks, we're going to go back down there. We're going to be bound. We're going to be determined. We're going to get that sword and suit.
That's my vow. As a guy that might go back on his vow. This is Bobo the Vulture. This is Let's Play Castlevania, Aria of Sorrow. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.